Sessions refused to fire Strzok and Page even after Trump gave the order by Aaron Moreno for truthfeednews.com. Now we know why Strzok and Page still have a job. According to an exclusive report by Vox, both Jeff Sessions and FBI Director Christopher Wray have refused to fire anti-Trump FBI agents Peter Strzok and Lisa Page even after President Trump gave the order more than once. From Vox, President Donald Trump sharply questioned Attorney General Jeff Sessions and FBI Director Christopher Wray during a White House meeting on January 22nd about why two senior FBI officials, Peter Strzok and Lisa Page, were still in their jobs despite allegations made by allies of the president that they had been disloyal to him and had unfairly targeted him and his administration, according to two people with knowledge of the matter. Meanwhile, even the text messages prove it. Uh, So the president also pressed his attorney general and FBI director to work more aggressively to uncover derogatory information within the FBI's files to turn over two congressional Republicans working to discredit the two FBI officials according to the same sources. The very next day, Trump met Sessions again, this time without Ray present, and even more aggressively advocated that Strzok and Page be fired, the sources said. Trump's efforts to discredit Strzok and Page came after Trump was advised last summer by his then-criminal defense attorney John Dowd that Page was a likely witness against him in special counsel Robert Mueller's investigation into whether Trump obstructed justice according to two senior administration officials. That Trump knew that Page might be a potential witness against him has not been previously uh, previously reported or publicly known. Yeah, right. Give a give us a break. The effort to discredit Strzok and Page has been part of a broader effort by Trump uh, and his allies to discredit and even fire FBI officials who they believe will be damaging witnesses against the president in Mueller's obstruction of justice probe. Uh, I don't get that. The effort to discredit uh, Strzok and Page has been part of a broader effort by Trump and his allies to discredit and even fire FBI officials who they believe will be damaging witnesses against the president in Mueller's obstruction of justice probe. Are you kidding me? If there was anything that they had, it would have come out. Uh, Maybe they're blaming, they're saying that this is what they're claiming, um, that Mueller and uh, the rest of the FBI and everything else, but (laughs) this is totally ridiculous. If they had anything on Trump, they would have, you know, they would have uh, already released it months ago. You know what I'm saying? No, this is not an effort to discredit them. It's an effort to get this country back on its feet again instead of wasting taxpayer dollars and upsetting the American people over this bogus Russia uh, uh, Trump investigation. That's, That's basically it. And Sessions is letting everybody run rampant. He won't fire Rosenstein. When it was said that Rosenstein would be fired... Sessions uh, threatened to resign. I said good riddance and so did the rest of you guys. And now uh, Strzok and Page are still on the payroll. So is Rosenstein. So is Ray. The deep state is uh, really growing, I think. You know, it's, it's, you know, still there. It's still there. I don't know what it's going to take to drain this swamp. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.